Good morning and welcome to another video from Santa Heath Golf Academy. My name is Christian Baker. What I wanted to share with you this morning was just a very, very simple video about how we can get the correct ball position. It's often a, a subject that people find very complex and they're trying to move it millimeters for every shot, and that's really not necessary. So what we're gonna use is what's called a static ball position. So let me explain that to you. To start with, for our irons, we're gonna have the ball always positioned four inches inside our left heel. So whether I've got a wedge, a six, or a four iron, the ball will always be four inches inside my left heel. And then all I do is I move my right foot further away as these irons get longer. So let me demonstrate that to you. Kitchen wedge to start with, golf ball four inches inside my left heel. And then I'd have my right foot relatively close to the cane. And you can see that the ball appears to be relatively centered in my stance. Now as I then move to a six iron, I'll move my right foot out a little bit. And that will give the appearance that the ball is slightly further forward in my stance. And as I go to my four iron, I'll move my right foot out maybe a fraction more. And that will give the appearance that the ball has moved even further forward. But it's very easy for me to get correct because of my left foot never moving. All I've moved is my right foot into three different positions. Okay, now I'm gonna to come to a rescue or a fairway wood. So for a rescue or a fairway wood, I still want a descending blow, but not as much as with an iron. So what I'm gonna do this time is I'm gonna move the ball just two inches inside my left heel. So this time you can see I've got it just two inches inside my left heel, and then I move my right foot out to roughly shoulder width, okay? So now we can see I'm gonna get a very similar position for my three wood and my rescue. And then from here, the last club in the bag is my driver. Now with a driver, I actually want an ascending blow. So I want to be hitting up on the ball and that's gonna maximize my distance. So in order to do that, what I'm gonna do this time is have the ball one inch to be in opposite my left heel. So somewhere between that position there. And I have my right foot out slightly wider than shoulder width. The ball now appears right off my front foot. That's gonna help me get up on the ball nicely. Okay, so a very simple way to get the ball position correct. Effectively, you only have three things to get. You've got your irons, which is four inches. Your fairway woods and your rescues, about two inches. And your driver, roughly an inch or off the left heel. Find where's comfortable for you. Okay, hope that helps and have fun practicing that.